Hello everyone, I'm Colin Kinnett and today I'm back for those of you who have been following the Live Edge coffee table, uh, this is what it looks like and I wish you could see or feel the top here. I've finally wet sanded it with 600 grit and honestly it's just like silk, it's just beautiful. But what I need to do today is I'm going to be putting the legs on and I've never done this before but in this case I'm going to be putting on some steel legs so let me show you these. Now these legs came raw so they came as silver steel, as raw steel, they had oil on them, um, they were welded together and they look just the way they are right now except they were steel. So what I've done, uh, and I've done all this off camera, I've had to clean them uh, and give them a light sanding with a, a very very fine, almost like a steel wool and then I gave them an undercoat with a primer, a black primer and then an overcoat with a, a satin, again an automotive uh, paint uh, and these were expensive <laughs> paints and what they've turned out with is just, they're just outstanding the way they look. You can see um, there's a very very um, fine sheen to them and I did all this outside so that all of the spraying and so on, all of the odor and I left them outside for a few days so that all of the odor would dissipate so there's literally no odor at all to anything right now uh, and everything is nice and dry and hard. Now what you're looking at is some squares that I've put on there and those are just a very thin plywood and I put those on there just to make sure that I don't have any splits anywhere in the wood uh, and also to give me a little bit more depth to put screws into. So what I'm going to do because I don't know I, I actually had this top professionally uh, sanded with a, somebody who has a 24 inch wide belt sander um, and they made sure that it was flat for me on both sides and it, it should be flat but I don't know if there's been any wood movement so what I'm going to do today I'm going to attach uh, one set of legs and I'm going to attach a, a set of legs on the other side but just one side then I'm going to take it to my table saw and flip it up because I need an absolutely flat area and what I might I may have to shim this a little bit because I want these legs to be absolutely flat so the, the bed of my table saw is absolutely flat and I may have to shim one side just one edge or the other I don't know but the way I figured out where these are going to sit on my on my bench right now or on my table top is I've l got this wood that's just going to lift off this piece of plywood that I'm going to put on and I've made a piece of plywood that is exactly 30 inches long and what it's going to do and it's parallel on the two ends so what it's going to do now is now when I take some time here and I'll do this all off camera I'm going to position I'll measure this side and this side and make sure that they're nice and even on each side and then this wood now ensures that my legs are going to be parallel because I'm working with live edge wood here there's really nothing that I can line up on any of the sides here because they're all a little bit different so I'm going to eyeball it actually looks just about right there and I can see that it's just, it probably has to go about like that and that should line up perfectly but I'm going to check it off camera and then we'll start putting some screws in.
Well, as luck would have it, there is, there's no need to, to shim. It's actually perfectly flat. So all I need to do now is finish screwing the last two legs or the last two screws in the side of this leg. See how that is. Oh, that's better. Yeah, good. All right, well, that's it. This is uh, a very interesting design and I've never worked with these steel legs before. I love these legs. Uh, they're a lot less work, but uh, they're a bit more industrial looking. I like that. So the next pictures you'll see will be in somebody's home. Well, and that concludes my video on making the Live Edge coffee table, and that was three episodes long. Uh, and of course, this last one has just been installing the legs, and I've never worked with steel legs before, uh, but I think I'm going to do it again because I really like the look of them. So I'm Colin Kinnett for Woodwork Web. Thanks for watching.